In 2019, the resource recycling rate in Taiwan reached 55.14%, and the rate of resources reused was as high as 86.23%. The high recycling rate is because of the implementation of resource recycling by everyone in their daily life. Recycling in daily life is quite simple and convenient. In addition to handing over the recyclable resources to the recycling vehicle, we can experience different recycling channels and go to any resource recycling stations which are set up in various villages. For example, we can exchange our old items for household goods in some of the village resource recycling stations as recycling incentives for the community. After using paper containers, let's follow these three steps. Clean, sort, and stack. These three steps aid in resource disposal. We can choose to eat at the restaurants with the label Restaurants with Recyclable Paper Container, which are equipped with special facilities for recycling paper container so that we can protect our environment while enjoying delicious food. If the batteries in electronic devices can no longer function in high power consuming ones, you can use them in other devices with low power consumption, such as calculators, remote controls, or clocks. When the battery's power has been completely exhausted, they should be properly collected and then brought to convenience stores, recycling vehicles, village resource recycling stations, and hypermarkets for recycling. We have reached the digital age where everyone owns a cell phone. However, when IT items are going to be replaced, everyone is worried about the data breach after the disposal of his or her IT gadgets. But there's no need to worry. We have provided a service to protect the information in your tablets by destroying waste tablets with external forces in order to secure your data information so that everyone can feel reassured when recycling IT items. Recycling is so simple and easy that we can be closer to the green life towards a sustainable future.